Hello YouTube, this is Everything is Tech, and in this video, I will have a speed test between my Dell XPS M1530 and my MacBook Pro, which is a 2.66 GHz model. So before I do continue on, I will do the usual routine, and if, uh, to the people, you do not, you do not know what this is, it's basically where I compare the shutdown, boot up, and even how long it takes to render a video for both these computers. Now, one's running Leopard and another is running Vista. So I'll probably not be using the same exact program to render these videos. So therefore I'll probably use iMovie for my MacBook Pro and for my laptop, Adele, I'll most likely use Sony Vegas. And, well, let's continue. Okay, so both computers are off. I have my NV3 and I'm going to have it as a stopwatch. So I'm just kind of going to get down here and add my thumb on this. Three, two, one, go. It is 10 seconds. And we got the Apple logo on the MacBook Pro. On the Dell, we have it's loading, Microsoft Corporation. And the Mac Pro booted up in uh, 30 seconds. Uh, actually, 27. 27. And now we have the Dell booting up right now. And da uh, and it booted up in 44 seconds so I think we can clearly say that the MacBook Pro is almost two times faster than the Dell when it's actually uh, booting up now we're gonna actually shut them off and uh, actually go here here start MacBook Pro shut down in two seconds 44 sec two seconds and this kind of didn't shut down. Oh, actually, it just shut down. It just took actually, it just took a while to actually. Yeah, this uh, it was actually shutting down. It just took a little, uh, a few extra seconds to actually close all the programs and stuff. So, yeah, it's 30 seconds now. 31. And the MacBook Pro, two seconds. Shut down. 39 seconds. Uh, yeah, 39 seconds it took down. And it took the MacBook Pro, two seconds. So, again, I think the MacBook Pro is definitely faster than the laptop so far. The Dell laptop. But then again, the MacBook Pro is a 2.66 GHz Intel to Duo. And the laptop has a 2.0 GHz. So there is a big difference. So here I am with my two computers, and I'm about to render the same same image. It's actually a picture of a tree on that on my MacBook Pro, and same thing on my laptop. And here's kind of it. I'll move it. Yeah, there we go. And these are both 141 kilobytes. So let's go save. Save over here. And save right here. Three, two, one, go. That started. And I will come back and tell you how long it actually took to uh, render this video. They are, they are rendering in 720p, uh, 720p, 6 FPS. So I will come back and tell you how long it took. So I am back, and for for the MacBook Pro to render that image, a uh, 10 minute image, it took um, around, I believe, 12 minutes. And for my laptop, it took around 20 minutes, 19 minutes. So there's a difference over there, a little few minute difference. So again, if, you, if you're looking for a faster machine, and I, I would definitely suggest the MacBook Pro. I would actually, overall, suggest the MacBook Pro because it has a good spec. And even if it runs Leopard, it does not make much of a difference really the same thing but just a different operating system and now here we go for the last 
uh, last test, I should say. I'm gonna go exit that out here. Okay, that's exited out. Now, the program I'm actually gonna open is iTunes. And I'm not even gonna time this, I'm just gonna sh show, the, sh show all y'all how long it actually takes. So I'll go to iTunes over here. Three, two, one, go. And it loaded up fast on the MacBook Pro. And a few seconds later, it loaded on the laptop. So, overall, I'd probably say the MacBook Pro is definitely faster than the laptop. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Everything is tech. If you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that yellow button. And don't forget to comment and rate this video. Thanks for watching.